What do I do? Um, talk, chat, lie. It's what everyone else does when they meet someone new. Look, at the end, you're gonna write down the name of the two you dug most, and if either of them has you on their list, then you go on a real date, and maybe they'll get lucky. I also collect sugar spoons. You know the ones that I mean? The kind I sell in really cheesy tourist shops? You know the kind that I mean? Uh, yeah. Hey, did you know that there are 13,092 eating utensils in the White House? Really? <laughs> and we still didn't have our food. Uh, we were totally starving. I mean, another two minutes, and we probably would have eaten the table. What? So, what kind of hobbies do you have? Hobbies? Uh, uh, well, uh, sometimes when I'm bored, I like to test Stephen Hawking's hypothesis on uh, quantum cosmology, and theory, and anthropic principle. Whatever. Popcorn, chips, just about any kind of junk food that you can think of. <laughs> <laughs> I like hot dogs. Spicy hot dogs. Love spicy hot dogs. Give me a Mariner's dog any day of the week. <laughs> so, John Doe? Odd name. Mm. My parents were always full of surprises. At least while I knew them. Oh no, did something happen to them? No, yes, well, one way of putting it. You know, I, I, I don't really remember them. Poor thing. So where'd you grow up? Twin Falls, Idaho. Population 34,469. You're kidding me. As of the last census. No, I mean TFH. You went there too? Wow, what are the odds? Roar, Bruins, roar! <laughs> of course. Twin Falls, Bruins, fight song. <laughs> so gosh, I wonder if we like ever pass each other on the street or something? Oh, doubtful. Uh, we moved. Oh. My dad got a job. Istanbul oil drilling. But I thought you said you didn't know your parents. So, spill it. How'd it go? Oh. Uh-oh. Sorry. I'm sorry. I was just trying to help. So what'd you do? Go talk in Encyclopedia Britannica again? You're dead, didn't you? I didn't know what to say. Hint. Whatever they want to hear. You know, you have no idea what it's like to have zero personality. I mean, that girl. I had a connection for like three seconds. Never mind. My third wife had no personality. We were married for four years. I've answered all your questions already. I'm not with the police, Dr. Jensen. Oh, then there's the door. Did you know Bowen had a twin? I've recently become aware of that, yes. And you didn't tell the police? It's irrelevant. He's a psychophysiological coper. It inflicts violence inward, never towards others. Your techniques. Are you employing Freudian psychoanalytics, forensic methodology? Hardly. I resurrect the repressed past, forcing the patient to relive the memories in order to confront them. Resurrect the past? How? Hey, if I spill all the dirty details, who's going to pay admission? Come see the show. Biofeedback, guided visualization. I mean, these haven't been proven to work for total memory loss. Quite the student of psychotherapy. Hobby. So, if you're not a detective, who are you? Something about you. A yearning. What are you hiding, Mr. Doe? I have retrograde amnesia. You're kidding. No. Yeah. Uh, curious, what's your first memory? 
Nothing. It's fascinating. You know, Mr. Doe, buried beneath the cranium, there is a long and winding path, a history filled with the echoes of those once known. Mother and father, sisters, brothers perhaps, girlfriends, a wife. The mine's a locked door. Don't you want the key? Why the concern? You suffer the consummate psychological ailment. I just want to prove I've got the consummate cure. Sensory deprivation chamber. How am I doing? Easy. Easy. You're in trusted hands. Now, relax. Deep breaths. Allow the sedative to take hold, gently rocking you into slumber. <laughs> Don't fight it. Free yourself from the fear, the debilitating chains that constrain the mind. You're winding through a tunnel. A seemingly endless tunnel, one step at a time. Faster now, speeding into the far reaches of the subconscious. Faster. Faster. Is he recording sessions? Yes, on infrared camera. That's all. The tape's gone. Brainwave activity. Memories. Where is he? Where's the tape? I don't know. I can't find it. Why the hell were you back at the puzzle house in the first place? I wanted to experience his therapy firsthand, better understand for the case. So this is about my case, or is this about you? Both. I got your Bowen's therapy tape. Well, fortunately for you, my alien friend, we already had a search warrant. Now look, I got half a damn corpse. I got Ringling Brothers in lockup, and now this? You shouldn't have been over there without me in the first place, John. Frank, there are things about me you don't understand. There are things about me I don't understand for no, that matter. You know what? I'm sick and tired of... Hayes. Copy that. We got something. Let's go. So you found Yin Yang. Nonetheless, she's been in a Ziploc. Fresh kill. Numero dos. Herp was kind enough to leave her purse behind. Ms. Angela Norton, West Seattle. I'll look for a connection. Yeah. Oh, and Mark, get on the physical. I want to know if we have any more of Bowen's mysteriously appearing DNA. At least we know Doc doesn't have much of an alibi.